Okay, so today we're going to be working on rear shocks for my Winnebago Journey 2008. So it looks like the easiest way to do these shocks is going to be to take the rear tires off. And also their right-handed threads, not left-handed threads, or whatever. They're opposite. Now we can see the shock in there. You can also see our leveler. These bolts are one and an eight. I actually took the nut off the other bolt while it was over there on the on the ground. I was laid on the ground. But I determined while I was laying on the ground there was no way I could really do this job. Alright. So one shock out. Very easy to do though with the with the wheels off. Maybe. Oh great. That shocks at the end of its limit, I think. I can't push it down anymore. To get it in there, so let me get a jack. To jack this axle up a little bit just to get that 
have a bolt in there. There's that ball and bolt. It's good and tight. Now we just got this top one. Alright. One down, one to go. stem to come through one of these holes here.
All right, this side, this piece goes counterclockwise to get it off. The other side goes clockwise. I didn't put the carburetor on the lug nuts on the other side because I'm going to torque the lug nuts down. But I'll do that all at once. wondering what that noise is behind me. There's a dirt road behind me and they're grading the road. Come by about well, once a month I think. Top. 
And there's the bottom. Torque my lug nuts, I'm going to use a torque multiplier. And a torque wrench. Already set up for the for the right uh, torque settings.
tell you, it is hot here in Florida. This one got me some water. I do have some nice shade here, though. Gotta put our chrome covers on for the lug nuts. A nice little breeze blowing. And remember this thread is reverse, it's a reverse thread, so <clears throat> you have to twist it like you're taking it off to put it on. We'll just snug it up. Right. right there is good. All right, that's it. Just replacing the shocks on your 2008 little bit of a journey on a Freightliner XC chassis. Thanks for watching.